Hey guys, today we are going to be talking about the properties of graphs and more specifically the graphs of quadratic equations, okay? So the way we do this is we are actually going to determine <clears throat> if um, the graph opens upward, okay? A graph that would open upward would be one that looks something like this or one that opens downward would look something like this, okay? So if it is positive, it opens up. If it is negative, it opens down, okay? You can even think of it as a, as a happy face, right? Like, so a happy face is a positive, right? And a, a frowny face is negative, okay? So <clears throat> we're going to determine if they open up or down. So the way we do that is the leading coefficient would be the coefficient, the number, okay, multiplied by the highest uh, power of x. So for instance, we'll start here, okay? So the number that is in front of the, uh, of the x squared, sorry, the highest power is the x squared in a quadratic formula, okay? And then what we want to do is find where or the number that is multiplied by the x squared. So right here I have a negative 3 that is multiplied by the x squared. That is negative. If I look over here, the negative is downward. So I say it's downward. Okay, you could just say down for uh, abbreviation's sake. And we also want to know, they want to know, uh, does this graph have a maximum or a minimum? Well, it doesn't get any higher than this, right? So that would mean that's a maximum. So if it's down, there's a maximum. So it's down max, okay? Let's look over here. The coefficient of the x squared here is seven, positive seven, right? So it is a positive and therefore it opens upward. So it opens up and the bottom right here, that's the minimum that it's gonna get, right? Because it can go higher, there's no max on this. So this would be a minimum. So we'll just say a min, okay? Now this one here, <clears throat> I am looking for the x squared. Here's the x squared. So the number that is in front of the x squared, the coefficient is negative four, it's minus four. So it's negative, it's negative. So negative open down. And on a negative, that's as high as it goes. So that's a max. So if it's down, it always has a max. If it is up, it has a minimum, okay? So you can't have an up, upward turning graph that has a maximum. It doesn't work that way. So down is associated with max, up is associated with min or minimum, okay? Let's go down here. I have y equals 5x squared plus 2x minus one. We find the x squared. There's the x squared right there. What number is in front of the x squared? That is a five, it is a positive five. Positive, it opens up. And up always has a minimum. Okay, over here, let's look for the x squared. Oh, that's tricky, that's for x. x squared is here, it's six. Okay, so that's positive. Positive opens up. And up always has a minimum. 